Matthew here from MiniWargaming.com, and it's time to play some more Space Hulk. Uh, a little while ago, I played through the free campaign, The Messenger of Purgatory. I believe that, um, yeah, that was that's a free one. And now I'm going to play through the next one. And then eventually I'll play through this one as well, Defilement of Honor. So I've actually, I've, I don't, I know nothing about this mission or this campaign. I don't know how long it is. don't know how hard it is. But all it says right here is recapture the, the sort of Helkeon. <laughs> this game is fun. I really, I do like this game. This game is good. It's just, it's just kind of uh, comedic, some of the things that are in it. Recapture the, the sort of Helkeon or Halcyon or whatever it's supposed to be. From the Gene Stealers Infestation. All right, so this sword is really important. So let's go get it. All right, so it looks like it's going to be five missions. Swiftly retrieve the weaponry that may remain aboard the vessel. So we got to do it swiftly. I, I don't know why they're sending in terminators to do something swiftly, but you know, whatever. Upon entering the warp, the space marine vessel, the Sword of Halcyon, crashed Halcyon. into okay. a massive space hull. The Sword of Halcyon fused briefly with the Space Hulk before breaking free and spinning back into reality. But the ship's contact with the Space Hulk had already left its curse upon the Sword of Halcyon. Scans showed a buildup of gene stealers in the prow sections of the ship. You have been assigned to command a force to recapture this vessel from the gene stealers. Our first step in reclaiming the Sword of Halcyon is to take the armory. It must be taken swiftly. The quicker the assault, the more chance there is of not only retrieving weaponry that may have remained on board, but also of making the vessel safe for future boarding action. Collect weapons from the Sergeant weaponry. Of the squad, <laughs> armory. Your armory. Orders. I accept. Two squads are at your command. Two squads is at your Terminators command. Wow. Here. It is spell check. Grammar check. Multiple threat groups are moving in from these areas. Retrieve the weaponry from these locations. Move with haste, my brothers. Time is of the essence. So I gotta collect the weapons from the armory. These ones right here. It doesn't tell me how, but I guess it'll tell me. And I have to do it swiftly. That shouldn't be too hard, considering that there's only these two right here. And so I can just book my way up there. And I got two squads. Like, this should be pretty easy, actually. Command points can be used across all Terminators and get refreshed each turn. Yes, I hope by this point people understand that one. But I guess they're random tips. <laughs> so let's see how this is. Hopefully it's not really super frustrating like the other one, but already it looks a lot easier. Terminators! Okay, what do we got? Squad Lexon. Oop. Has machinery actions that have to be performed or complete. Using an action zone with the Terminator will have a set cost of APs. To use an action zone, first move your Terminator to the marked tile. Click to have the Terminator perform the action. Some of the action zones requires that the Terminator is carrier of a certain object. Okay, so that basically tells me how it's going to be done. So I'm assuming, yeah, there they are. So i got to go on there and perform some sort of action to retrieve the weapons. Oh, looks like we've got another flamer. Oh, all right. And uh, some storm bolters. Those look important enough for a mission. Okay. Oh, it looks like gene stealers start deployed in there. So maybe that's what makes it a little harder. But nowhere near me. So okay. So what do we have? We got squad Lexon. So this is these are looks like they're different people. All right. So I get to know a, a new group of guys. And we got squad Jack Tail. We already have a flamer. What do we need these storm bolters for? We got two flamers and lots of storm bolters. I say we just abandon this place and not worry about all these weapons from the weaponries. See, collect weapons from the weaponry. Complete before the end of turn 14. Okay. So how are we going to do this? Well, we'll want Brother er er, brother Ermes out front. And Flamer will be in the middle. Put this yeah, in there. Okay, we'll do that for both sides. And the other one will Brother Leo, Ramiel, Adriano... Lexon and Ock. O C H. Alright, so let's deploy. Let's do this thing! Let's go kill some G Stealers. Your orders, sir. Yeah. My orders are move fast. Now I should do this smartly. Obviously I'm gonna just wanna shoot down doors and just advance down all the corridors. So let's start over here. You, my friend. How many okay, hold on, we got three command points. The reroll! Okay, three it is. So I'm gonna have him. Go here, then to here. Oh, right. 
right click or left click and have him use the extra command points because why not do 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 get a free shot should get a free shot right No dice. Oh, I can't fire? I'm out of command points? Did somebody move further than they were supposed to? Somebody moved further than they were supposed to. Oh well. Okay. So since speed is of the essence, obviously I just move fast. Oh, I should have had that. Well, whatever. And you can turn. Not really much more to do in that turn. Obviously gene stealers are going to be coming, but that's okay because they're really far away. They oh, and they're all revealing. Okay, I don't know why they'd want to do that. But hey, who am I to judge? An artificial intelligence who's not very smart. It's okay though, there's lots of them. Five command points, yes. Yes, please. So, okay, where are we? The problem is, I chose the High Fleet Kraken. You know, maybe I'll switch for this one. Options, never fantastic quality, yes. Do they let me change the Kraken? No, I can't change. I got to do that outside the mission, just so I can see them a little better. Because they're red and brown, and this level is red and brown. Okay, you are going to move here and turn and start shooting at that door. You think you can get it down, Hermes? Can you can you shoot down a door? No, sorry, Bob. You know I'm just going to have you move and fire at it. Nope. And oh, come on. Three shots? Really? Well, these guys are still pretty far away. So you can just open the door for one action point. And then everybody else will just kind of follow you. Do, 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 do. Nope. Just have you go. Do, 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 do. What about you, Leo? Can you shoot down a door? I'm going to do one at a time. You do. I want you to shoot the next door. No. So just open it. He presses the button. I love that. Just walking towards it, shooting at it like nothing else. And then he just presses the button. And shoot the next one. Nope. Okay. Whatever. I didn't actually want you to destroy it, so that kind of worked in my favor. That, that's a lie. But anyways, doesn't matter. Uh-huh. Uh. -huh. uh Huh? And I think we have two more command points. So those guys are up nice and far. Let's have you move up a little further. Yes! Good job! Alright, so Gene Sillers are still far away. So I'll have you use the rest to get over there as fast as you can. And I think that's everybody. Yep. No Overwatch yet. I'm moving as fast as I can, so if I can't beat this just by walking up this fast, then there's something wrong. Okay, here they come. Still have a couple more rounds before they can get to me, but definitely don't want to have some Overwatch going on here. Don't care if some guys die, as long as I make it through. Look at all of them, just swarming like insects. Six command points, yes. Yes, please. Okay, so this is where I need to start being a little more cautious. Uh, I'll still advance, see if I shoot it open. There we go. So they can only move one, two, three, four, five, six. So they can only get to there. Move up to here. Oh, so now they can only get to that one. Oh, this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, yeah, so I need to go on over with him. This guy needs to get over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, and yeah, so they're they're both four plus one. So I'll have him go here and shoot that door. They can't get to me, so I'm not gonna waste too many points on him. If he opens the door. Uh, well, I'll come back to him, see if I need to put him on Overwatch. Adriano will go that way. Sergeant will go that way. Backup dude will go over here. Okay, where are the other guys? So we're here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So he can get up to there. So I'll just have him advance too and go on Overwatch. Let them come. Oh, I will. Not really let them, but they'll come. So one, two, three, four, five, six, so I need to be back here. The only problem is, yeah, 
Uh, I'm gonna have to let them get close. This is where the flame roll will be useful. So you know what? Different tactics for this side. Flamer dude is going to run that way. And then he'll follow up. And then you can move. So you got two command points for the jams. Clear a path. And this overwatch guy, so I'm not gonna put this guy in overwatch. Because one, two, three, four, five, six, minus one for the door. This guy can't get to me anyways, so I'll just rely on shooting. I probably should have done the same thing, put the flame around this side. But it's okay, he can swing around. So, uh, yeah, that's everybody. As much as they can, go. And turn, go! G-Tillers, die! Okay, you can start. I have movement, brothers. Of course you can. Oh. Okay, there you go, see? There we are. First cat. oh no, second cat tree, I guess. I guess if they all come that way, that's going to be pretty easy. Let's all stream into the guy on Overwatch. That's that's our strategy. I'm like, okay, I will not give you any... Oh, he's closer than I saw. I don't see him. No. Um, okay, good. Unless he still gets to attack. Wow, that's a lot of guys. I almost wish that he would kill the guy in front so I could just flamer the rest. Six command points. Well, I guess I will take that. Come on. Okay. None shall survive. I got lucky. I'll just gun down a few of these. Because they're pretty darn close. Or I can get unlucky and waste all my ammunition. There we go. So that guy can come twice. I think I'll just have to... I think I'll just have to do that. The flamer guy will go on guard. Unbreakable fate. So, who's the closest to this guy? Him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's just try to shoot down this door. Moving ahead. Hey. Oh, he didn't have the thing on. Okay. Might as well set move and fire. Nope. Open door. And then we got a guy over here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So I could move up one more, but I'd rather go on Overwatch. The enemy will fall before me. And then you move up. Yes, brother. You move up and go on Overwatch, just in case you get lucky. Or I don't know, because everybody else in front of you is dead. And then we worry about this side. Okay, so we got some gene stealers coming in right here. I really should probably move back and go on Overwatch. Yeah, Overwatch. Overwatch protocol initiated. And then Flamer Dude. Okay, let's see. Who's the closest? One, two, three, four, five, six. So they can get there. I'll wait till they bunch up before I shoot the Flamer. Because he's only got, what, six shots? Yeah, six shots. And then we'll back him up. We'll back this guy up. Prepare yourself, brothers. Yeah, prepare yourselves. And then I should probably put an extra guy over here because the Flamer is not going to be shooting as much. Or eventually he's just going to be disposable because he'll run out of ammunition. And that's everybody. And we got three command points left over. Everybody's on Overwatch. That should be. This is the only one I'm really concerned about. Actually, the one on the other side, too. But maybe we'll get lucky and just shoot them all to death. Come on. See? There we go. See? The next guy is three, three away, so I'm not as worried about him. See? Okay, good. Didn't even jam. Oh, actually, I think he jammed the first one. It was a 5-5. Five, five. But that's okay. I wish I would show you how many command points you had left like in this screen. That would be useful. Yeah, that's right. Oh, he's using up all the command points, though. The guy on the other side is really close, too. He's so far so good. So far so good. We can do this. Oh, no. I think that's going to be all our command points. So the guy on the other side has to not jam. Otherwise, he is dead. Okay, so far so good. Okay, the other guy can still get to him and get one swing off. Oh, I got lucky there. <laughs> didn't see he didn't get all the way. Ah, oh, but the flamer's out front. Come on, guys, get a little closer. So the flamer can do his thing. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have the flamer out front. But I anticipated them all bunching up as they came down the other corridor, not towards the guy who's on Overwatch. Six command points again. I think all my luck going to get used up. And then, like, in one turn, I'm just going to die completely. All right. So these guys are nice and far away. So we are... Whoa, but he is not. See, this is the problem. See, if I shoot the flamer, I can't get to them because this guy's in the way. But it would have been perfect to burn them up. 
So how do I take care? And I don't think I can shoot it, kill him, and then shoot and kill them. And there's always that 17% chance that I don't kill him, and then he can just jump out and kill me. So this is a conundrum, and there's no way to get him back. What about swinging the other guy around? No. No, I've got a flame. All right. Flame on! Okay, got him. No, see? See? That's why. That's why I did it there and not there. Okay, well, that sucks. It holds up that corridor. So these guys are one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, he's close. Shoot. Let's use some of these command points to get up here and turn. Yeah, let's do that. And that way, if they start going that way, he gets to shoot at them too. It's going to eat up a lot of command points, though. They're going Overwatch. But. Stay alert, brothers. What the heck? And you might as well turn. Get in as best a position as we can. Go on Overwatch just because, hey, you never know. The guy could survive a 2 plus and then kill him. And then he can die to Overwatch shots. Okay, so on this side, we've got this guy who can go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'm already actually as close as I can get. I'd like to get closer, but there is this guy shooting Overwatch as he goes that way. So he technically should be pretty safe. So I think I'm going to take a bit of a chance because I'm already on turn. Five. I'm gonna have him move forward, and then go on Overwatch, and have him go behind. Now there's nobody here yet. They could get over there, but this is the time. Oh wait, yeah. See, he can come up and turn. Is that the flamer guy behind him? Ah, oh, it is. Shoot, I don't want the flamer guy leading the charge. But ah, oh, what the heck? Let's do it. Oh, I can't click on the next guy. This is an animation. Maybe I'll get lucky and kill that guy. Come on! Nope. And I don't have enough command points to put him on Overwatch. Like, I do, but that would be like, no jamming is allowed, and that just makes me nervous. Don't like that. Okay, so enter. Here we go. The guy in the fire is definitely dead. Oh, okay, good. And he's burned to death. Thank you. You guys need to all bunch up. Okay, good. See? He protected him, so now we're good. And these guys can all bunch up. Oh, or I can just kill them too. Wouldn't mind if a bunch bunched up together because then I just wouldn't feel so bad. Wow, okay, never mind. Just run into that overwatch. Don't come down the side where he can't see you. Just run right into it. I'm okay with that. Oh, we got one more command point, so don't waste it. Because we time is of the essence here, so I need to be able to advance. See, now that we're at this point, though... This is where all the gene sealers come from, so I can just keep guarding it. That's why I'm kind of sad that I have that flamer out front, because I can't do that for him. But I could use him to block the path, too. Have him shoot further forward. Maybe. Don't know what his range actually is. We'll find out, I guess, when I try to do it. But the rest should be pretty easy. Command points, three. Reroll. Four. Haha. <laughs> really pushing my luck. Okay, so he should be able to... See, this is a problem. I'm just going to be killing one. But, oh well. One's better than none. Hmm. 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 You know what? I'll wait. Just in case there's something better to do. Okay. Because really, if I cover this corridor, the problem is the flamer dude is not going to allow me to cover the corridor, and they, so they could still come down this way. So I do still need to advance this way. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm safe if I go up to here. Move. And then I can have the sergeant swing around. These guys move forward. I don't know why they need to go on Overwatch, but they will, because like you just kind of always do that. Um, yeah, you should go on Overwatch. And then you have lots of targets. See, this guy's like one, two, but I once again have a guy in Overwatch there. So let's use this opportunity. Let's see what he does when he moves up twice. All right, he got him. So now it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So, yeah, I'll take the chance. Move up one more and go on Overwatch. I need to close the gap as fast as possible. And so this guy, oh, once again, the flamer's out front. Okay, well, you might as well book it up there, flamer. And then you can go up right beside him. And then this guy can move up. And he can go on Overwatch two. Flying secured. That means he'll have to stay back a little bit. 
and go on Overwatch. See, I don't need the Flamer to shoot then. So when he moves forward, he'll get overwatched on two sides, and that should kill him, but it's still risky. Um, I could close the door to make it so he only gets to attack me once. I could go on guard. You know what? I'm going to go on guard. But why not shoot? Yeah, what the heck. And he burns to death. All right, so all that overwatch was redundant. And that's why I should have done it before. So one, two, three. So you know what? Since all that Overwatch, no, never mind. These Overwatches are still good. So here we go. It's as good as it gets. Let's see if I get lucky and shoot some more stuff there. There we go. What level? Are, what are we probably like, turn six or seven? So making my way up pretty fast now. I don't think this will be too bad. It's an interesting mission to have the time limit to kind of force you forward and not just like stay back. So that is one of the things of Space Hulk that. Be times where you just kind of sit back. Yeah, see, they're not going to get there. And then they'll die from Overwatch. Be dumb. And then we have more coming, but I'll be able to see them because that's, those flames will go away. All right, come on. How many command points? Give me six. What's taking so long? Three. Reroll. Six. See, that's what I'm talking about. Now these are really close. So I will buy myself some time. Hey, a lot of time. Back them up and go on Overwatch. Area. And now we can stop with the dumb flamer and have him move up here and have him march down that corridor and have the flamer behind ready to provide covering fire if he needs to. Well, not covering fire so much, but you know what I mean. Oh, wow. Yeah, they sure fire. do. Okay, so let's move forward. No, no dice. Okay, are, are there any other gene stealers? There's like no other gene stealers. So they really can't, they really can't get to me. So I'm just gonna use these command points to burn right through that guy. And go on Overwatch Holy to watch shit. that one. And then just yes, my lord. start making our way up. So I think having 10 Terminators in this is a little overkill. Oh, right, we still got this guy. That's fine. All right, and you are going to step aside and provide reinforcements where we need it. You are going to move forward. You're going to move forward. So how much Overwatch? I got this guy right here, and then maybe some coming out. So uh, if his gun jams twice, that's okay. That's one flank. I'll start flanking. Whatever. There we go. Not too worried. There, so you got him. Didn't even jam. Totally didn't have to be worried about that. There we go. See? Piece of cake. And then we got this side, and that's it. Is that really all the gene stealers? Oh, alright. I can take them. Oh, two command points. Reroll. Two command points. It is the way that fate wanted it to be. You ever felt that? Like, I don't believe in all that stuff. But, you know, sometimes. Oh, hold on. One, two, three. Three, four, five, six. So if he moves up to here, then they can't Secure actually come out in one turn. But like when you roll, and you're like, no, I don't like that roll. I'm going to do re-roll. Because it's some sort of rule lets you re-roll. And then you re-roll and you get exactly the same thing. You're like, okay. Guess that was meant to be. I've thought that sometimes. Even though I don't really believe that. It's just kind of fun to think about it anyways. Wow, we got so much overkill. It's so many extra terminators that I don't need. Uh, let's get a bolter guy, because the flamer guys, let's have them be back up. And you move there and turn. I think that's everybody. Oh, wait, we got somebody. Oh, sorry, Brother Leo, I totally forgot about you. I might have forgotten about you last turn. That's because you blend in. You're red. Everything's red in this level. Anybody else? No, we got two command points. What are we going to do with them? They can't, they can't come out. These guys, one, two, three, four, five, six, they could. So let's use them to, to go the on over. They sure will. Especially with hardly any... Well, oh, they're lurking over there. And that's it. Command points, two. Reroll. Two. Once again. It's just, I guess, what it's got to be. All right, so you're going to turn and go on Overwatch. That's kind of close. Weapon at the ready. But um, if you die, then oh well. Oh, wait. Is there stuff to shoot? Oh, man. I should have been shooting at this all along. Nope. Nope. 
Come on, you can get it. Yes, there you go. Let's get the next one, too. Nope. Alright. Flamer guy, you're going to come up here and turn, I guess. And everybody else can just kind of book their yes, way up. Brother, you're going to come up to here, so they can only lurk in that spot. Oh, I should have been shooting at those doors all along. Oh well. I do it one at a time. If I shoot through the one, I want to start shooting at the next one. Should be able to kill it by the time I get there. See, like that. So I can save myself the extra action point. Nope. Okay. Moving ahead. And then, oh yeah, we got these guys down here. And we got, oh yeah, you two. Huh, I really can't see them in this mission. <laughs> Where are you? Um, well, you might as well go on Overwatch. For enemy contact. Even though the chances of them pushing through those two are very slim, could happen. Because like they start right there, so it's like one, two, kill. Yeah, see, we got one down already. Not too worried here. Even if they start killing Terminators, it's like I'm so close to the objectives now. As long as the turn counter isn't too high. They're all coming out through there. Looks like he just decided to lurk all the Musos on one side. Oh, there's still more. After this guy. That's alright, you got one more command point. Weapon functional. Alright, no. How many more? Okay, just this last guy. How much damage can this one guy possibly do? They none. What was I saying? Oh, we got lurkers over here now, so we'll just do the same thing. Command points five. All right, well, we're just gonna walk up. See, got the door. And you can work on the other door. Wow, really? Okay. Wow, <laughs> that door just did not want to die. So you're gonna turn, you're gonna go on Overwatch. You are going to move up and turn and get ready just in case the sergeant goes down. So let's put you on. Ah, let's put you on Overwatch. Holding. And you just will stay there and look pretty. There we go. Now the door's down. Got all sorts of other people. All right, Flamer guy. Sorry, keep forgetting about you, Jack Tail. And then when the other squad is, everybody still gets to move. So you go on Overwatch. Flamer do just move forward. You can move forward, and you just stay back and go on Overwatch. So we're on turn 10 out of 14, so yeah, I think we're going to get there. Got two more command points. I'm going to hold on to those just for, like, jamming and stuff. Ha, <laughs> jamming, like, bands. Never mind. It's more like, not like that at all. Oh, he starts jamming right away. All right, we're going to start losing guys pretty fast. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, or he can kill it with his sword. Oh, and he's out of Overwatch. Oh, wow. He's not even on guard and he's killing them. I should just put those guys on guard. Uh oh, I think he's dead. No. Oh, my goodness. He's a beast. Sergeant Jacktail. I know he gets a plus one because he's a sergeant to his role. Yeah, no, he's dead. And he forces him to re roll one of theirs. And everybody else dies. Yeah, see ya. Wow. Now this one just all of a sudden got a little more difficult. But I think he can't go any further. Yeah, so we're fine. That was pretty swift how quickly I lost guys, though. So we got five command points. So let's just book this guy up. See, like, he can't even catch him. So let's have him go back and go on Overwatch. And then if he comes for him and then kills him, then these, this guy's pretty much in the clear. And over here, oh no, this guy. All right, so how many how many action points does it take to fulfill the objective? Let's see. Pick up weapon, one AP. So we've got five. So it'd be one, two, three. Yeah, I can win this right now. Let's just do that. So you pick up one, and you pick up one, and I the win. Weaponry has been collected. Victory is yours this day. 
on this day. I said, on this day. Well, okay, so that was pretty good. I lost a couple guys there at the end, and that was too bad. It would have been nice to get it. Maybe there's an achievement for winning it without uh, any casualties. But um, should have put the guy on guard. That was a lesson learned there. So pretty straightforward. So stay tuned for the next in this series of this uh, this collecting weapons from the weaponry and going for the Sword of Hysia or whatever it was. I can't remember what it's called. And, uh, of course, you can check out Space Hulk on Steam. Just go buy it. It's a lot of fun, actually. And especially if you played the, the board game, it's a lot of fun, even though I kind of uh, make fun of some of the... The, the other things like it's it's obviously not your 10 out of 10 type of game but it is it is worth it so anyways this is matthew from mini wargaming happy wargaming